So the theme you've chosen for your presentation looks pretty good, but you want to make a few changes. You could edit each slide individually, but a better solution is to edit the master slides. Learning how to work with master slides can be a little challenging, but the reward is well worth it. To get started, click Slide, then Edit Master. The new editor will open over top of your presentation. Here, instead of editing individual slides, you are editing slide layouts. Along the left side, you'll see all of the layouts in your theme. And if you look closely, you'll see a yellow outline around the currently selected layout. If you were to make changes to this layout, those changes would be applied to each slide in your presentation that uses this layout. If you want to make changes that affect the whole presentation, select the master slide at the top. Editing a master slide is similar to editing a normal slide in your presentation. You can add and remove elements, change text formatting, and more. For example, you can click the title text to select it, go to the toolbar, and make it italic. If you look closely, you'll see that the titles in all of the slide layouts are now italic as well. If you also want to change the color of the text, click Text Color. You have two options at this point. You could simply choose a new color for the text, or you could choose to edit the theme colors. The advantage of editing the theme colors is that you can change the color everywhere it's used in the presentation, not just in the title. Let me show you what I mean. Click the pencil icon to open the theme colors pane. Then click the drop down. There are several theme colors to choose from, but we want text and background one. Then choose a new color. When you look at the slide layouts, you'll see that not only has the title color changed, but the background color on several other layouts has changed as well. That's the power of using theme colors. You can update your entire presentation with just a few clicks. Let's go back to our presentation. Click the X in the top right to close the theme colors pane, and then again to close the master slides editor. Now we can see that the new color and title formatting has been applied to the presentation. This is looking pretty good, but I do want to make a few more changes. I want the blue box on the title slide to be larger, but there's a problem. I can't select it. That's because the blue box is part of the slide's layout not of the slide itself. To edit the layout, once again go to Slide, Edit Master. Now you can select and edit all of the elements. I'll click and drag the box's sizing handle to make it larger, and I'll hold the Control key while dragging to make it resize from the center. That helps keep everything lined up. Then I'll select the white outline and size it up as well. There, I like that better. When I close out of the editor, I can see that my title slide has updated. As you can probably tell, learning how to work with master slides is a little tricky, but it's also super useful. Another benefit is that it's easy to import your customizations into a new presentation as the theme. Here's how that works. Open the presentation into which you want to import your customized theme, then click Theme in the toolbar. The Themes pane will open, and at the bottom, there's an option to Import Theme. A new window opens, and you will see all of your Google Slides presentations. Choose the right presentation, then click Select. Next, select the theme, and click Import Theme. Congratulations! You have just imported your own custom theme into a new presentation. GCF Global, creating opportunities for a better life.